what I really was struggling with is how do you account for the way school systems and schools affect what goes on between teachers and students in classrooms? And that's been my life question. I mean, that, that's a question I'm still asking. I, I think I have better answers than I had 40 years ago, but I still don't have a definitive answer. But if I was talking about a life guiding question, it was how does the way schools are put together, the way they're organized, the way they're managed, the way they're led, affect what happens between teachers and students in classrooms?